What's up, everybody? I'm Aaron. I'm eating some kind of vegetarian sushi shit. Yeah. They didn't. They had the big party platter, and I decided to get you a. I decided to get that one because, frankly, I didn't feel like eating, you know, grocery store sushi. But anyway, this is TOC plays uh, Pokemon Leaf Green. So, as you saw in the last episode, we beat the gym. Do my victory dance. Now we're moving on to, I guess, this way. But well, first, you should heal first. Yeah. But first, let me take him to the center. <coughs> Sushi's not sushi unless it has fish. Yeah. You should go talk to that scientist looking dude right there. Hello, scientist dude. Not that guy. The guy that looks like a scientist. Yeah, he kind of looks like a scientist. He's old and got a big head. That one sitting in the chair? No. The one that was outside. <laughs> okay. That scientist looking dude. Oh, yeah, him. <laughs> Oh, hello, Cosby. How are you doing? It's me, one of Professor Oak's aides. Everyone <laughs> Professor Oak's has dad. aides. <laughs> Did you meet the other aide? Aides, 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 aides. He had a package from Professor Oak for you, Cosby. So that's all you had to tell me? Fine, fuck you. Uh... Go down and right. What's in here? Travel through the lower. Diglett's cave. Diglett, dig, 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 dig. Trio, trio, trio. Well, isn't this a surprise? Diglett dug this long tunnel. Hmm. So I guess I go down? No, you piss on the wall. Fuck and it. a magical rainbow pony will appear. You cannot possibly get lost in this cave. I'm a diglet. <laughs> Go, pussy whips. It's truly you proof. Well, fuck. He kicked your ass. <coughs> hmm. Y you don't have to fight him. Just throwing that out there. Yeah, I know. You have to fight him. Yeah, Dig's not going to work on that. Oh, fuck. I ate your head, motherfucker. I get it. You can do fucking earthquakes, motherfucker. Magnitude's a weird move, though, because it's a, a random number generator. And if, I believe if the number oh, fuck. is the same as the last number of your level, yeah, then it does double damage. Or something like that. You scratched my penis. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if I capture a diglet, I'm going to name it Nub. Hey, look. It's a diglet. Imagine that. In Diglet's cave. 
What else could you have possibly fought in a Diglett cave? <laughs> Doug Trio. Nah. I'm holding out for Feroes. <laughs> Those are birds. Yeah, in case I know. You didn't know. All right, penis. Let's let's get through this. Wow, Diglett's cave is a lot bigger in this version than the original version. Yeah. At least remember that playing some of the Pokemon games. In the original red and blue, it was like left. It doesn't affect up, penis. Left up. Done. <laughs> Your magnitude doesn't affect my penis. Ha uh ha. -huh. So definitely need to keep using flying types here. Ah, uh, you know we get it. It's a Diglett cave. <laughs> you know what? It's a really fucking long Diglett cave. <laughs> Send Peckerball out there. He's a flying type. Who stands on the ground? Oh fuck! <laughs> Way to go, Peckerball! You scratched my pecker ball. Speaking of scratching balls. Oh, motherfucker. I get it. You're here. This is your cave. Go fuck yourself. I'm not really sure how to put this into words <laughs> that are appropriate. <clears throat> no, we can talk about it after the episode. Well, uh, basically, I was like doing the whole shower and shave thing. Yeah. Oh, God. And. <laughs> You gave yourself a vasectomy, didn't you? No. <clears throat> For some reason, I didn't take my glasses off when I was shaving. Just odd, because I always do. So I had to clean them afterwards. Wasn't thinking about it. And the people listening can't see this, but... When I clean my glasses, I always clean them, you know, facing the floor. Yeah. Yeah. The the spray that you shoot on glasses mm. burns like a motherfucker. Oh, yeah, because it's like Windex, dude. On the scrotum. I wonder if this is... Hi, remember me? I want a Professor Oak's AIDS. Like, I was totally... What the fuck? I think you lied to him. <laughs> <laughs> Flash. Because ah. I'm pretty sure you have not caught 10 Pokemon. <laughs> Apparently I have. You are so fucking lucky. <laughs> oh, you know what it is? But it counts Pidgeotto and Wartortle as like I can use the ether to wake up my Pokemon, can I? No. That's uh, PP boost. Yeah. <laughs> e even though Squirtle and Wartortle are the same thing, 
It counts it twice. Nothing down here, I guess. Nope. That's just if you want to go back to Viridian City. But now you gotta go back through Diglett Cave. Oh, great. <laughs> Motherfucker. I gotta find a Pokemon Center or something. I don't know, maybe I have a... I, do I have a rope? What? <laughs> I was to say, do I have a revive? I was getting all pissed off because I kept running into wall. <coughs> Why do you need a revive? My mouth is, uh, you know, pussy whips is down. So? Oh yeah, I really don't. I really shouldn't use pussy whips through here. Besides, even if everybody else dies in the cave, it'll just take you back to the Pokemon Center and the last town you were in. With Vermil everything, Vermilion. With so. everything I've still got? Or, you know, since I got that new, uh... Yeah. This is like a little kid RPG. You don't lose quest items. Good. Awkward silence. Yeah. I'm focused. <laughs> there you go. Fuck us. He hit me three times. Pecker ball used. Gust. Okay, he gets the... Mucho gusto. <laughs> Mucho gusto. There, I'm gonna get Pecker Ball some experience. <clears throat> I'm fucking tired. Yeah, I mean, you told me you've only had like five hours of sleep in what four days, three days, uh, something like that. Yeah. Dude, I don't think you realize it's a bird. <laughs> Damn it, I hate when I do that. I'm actually kind of hoping <clears throat> that we have enough Harvest Moon footage stocked up. And we don't have to do that today. Cut it kind of early today. I would not be able to stay awake through Harvest Moon <laughs> right now. Just because it takes so long? Yeah, and... Pretty much everything that we would get to today is... Really boring, like the Cow Festival. Yeah. Which I don't have cows, so... Yeah, why, f why fucking bother? I was, saying, I was about to ask you if you wanted Monster Energy drinks today, but I brought Mountain Dew instead, so there's caffeine. Mm -hmm. Still waiting on that sponsorship for Monster. I like the blue one. Oh, fuck. <coughs> he can't touch you. Do, 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 do. No. He's underground. How did you expect to hit him? Well, I didn't. So there wasn't really anything I could do. But if you had used Gust, he'd have gone first because he's faster. Ah, oh, fuck. I totally didn't think about that.
I was just wasting a fucking move is all I was doing. Oh look! It's angry Japanese guys. This is gonna this is gonna suck. Yeah, they're ten levels higher than you. I can't outrun them. <clears throat> but you're good as long as I keep using dig. No, oh, you're fucked. Nope. That was fucking like the he <clears throat> I have a fucking spot right at the edge of my forehead, like right where the hair starts. Yeah. It's fucking itching like crazy and I don't know why. But it's like one of those itches that it feels so good when you scratch it. Yeah. You know, like when you have a phantom itch on your balls <laughs> yeah. and like you got to hunt it and it's all like, it feels like it's right here, but when I scratch right there, it's over here. So let me go over here and scratch. Oh, nope. Now it's back over here. Oh, there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's that kind of itch. Of course, penis is attacking. He <laughs> dug underground and still was hurt by poison. Ah, oh, you died. Damn, penis is going to get a lot of points for this. <clears throat> that was less than I thought he was going to get. Oh, sweet. Finally made it out. So, let's see. I could use an awakening. Better go back to the Pokemon Center. Everybody wa everybody that watches this is probably like, what the fuck is Aaron doing? Where the fuck is he going? I don't know. Boop, boop, booby, boobs. Spending time at the titty club. <clears throat> I want to say we've got, but you were talking about stock footage. I want to say we've got a good bit of stock footage for um, Harvest Moon. Yeah, I think we should be good. So I guess I have to go this way. Yep. <clears throat> so I'm pretty sure in the last session... We did a couple of extra episodes. Yeah. Ekans. Go, Peggerball! And... My time frame is correct. When this goes up, it'll be two days before Soda City. Yep. So... We'll be gearing up for that shit. Yeah. Or, I'm wrong, and it's the week after Soda City. In which case, that was fun. I had a good time. What was your favorite thing about Soda City? Uh, the cosplayers. Yeah, they were cool. Especially that one... You know which one I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. And then her friend, who was that other thing. Yeah. <clears throat> and then they were all like, fuck it. Lesbian cosplay orgy. <laughs> Uh, 
Good times. Good times. Spiro. We tried to film it for you guys, but they were all like, you need a permit to film that kind of stuff. And I was all like, what the fuck do you mean I need a permit? And they were all like, well, this would receive an XXX rating from the Motion Picture Association of America. And I was like, fuck them. So I turned my camera off and walked away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to make this quick. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Hello! Oh. Oh. You want some popsicles? I have them in the cellar. <laughs> you can almost see my nuts. <laughs> he has one very smooth leg, and the other one is like all varicose veins and not shaved. <laughs> I know who to send in. Oh shit! Made a good decision. Now watch him fuck it up by picking something stupid. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, I know how this works. Vulpix. Vulpix. That, that's a fire type. Yeah, I want to get uh, Pussy Whips a little bit of leveling, so. Just send it out and then switch back to my, my Jizza. Mm. I imagine you could use Tail Whip if you got nine fucking tails. No, it's a Vulpix. Yeah, I, I get it. That, that was being funny. <laughs> Were you? Yes. It has nine tails. No, it's a Vulpix. Yeah, I know. It's kind of like who's on first. Well, what's on second? <laughs> exactly. Oh, that's Pokeball over there. Ah! Didn't make it. If he'd used the Firestone, then it would be a Nine Tails. Would a Sand Shrew be worth it? No. I don't think so, anyway. You need to get a fire type at some point, though. And a ghost type. Can't hurt. As soon as I can find a fire type. Well, there's always Cinnabar Island. Mmm. <laughs> Cinnabon Island. <laughs> Dude, my iPhone lied for me. It said I was at Cinnabon. Alright, I'm running from this motherfucker. There's not enough experience here worth it. Oh, fuck it. Yeah. Fuck you, Grandpa. What's up with the rock here? 
There's probably something there. It's also a Pokeball on the lower route. Keep going down. Oh, yeah, there is. Yeah, there is. I found a great ball. Goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Yeah. <laughs> there. What's up with the police? No, it's not that hard to think up good names. Oh, I can't wait to meet this guy. He doesn't actually rate them. What's up here? Oh, that transfer bullshit. Nope. It's binoculars. Oh, really? Let's look out the binoculars then. This episode's almost over. Hey, I can see some tits! <laughs> Hi, remember me? I'm one of Professor Oak's aides. You can go suck a dick. <laughs> you lied. Nope. Nope. Oh, oh well. What are you going to do? Fuck it. <laughs> Bye, dicks. Okay. I hope they fix that. Do you that. even know how to door? <laughs> well, like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> yeah. You can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Check out the merch shop. See you in the next video.